Hi guys! Okay, this project is going to be slightly different from the DIY recipes that I do. This one is more like a, a DIY project that you can do with the help of your dog. Um, it's something like this. That's Hoobie's paw print. It's yours! Okay, anyway, for you guys who don't know, this is Hoobie! I have another dog named Scotch, but he's really not into like this kind of... He's basically just really grumpy, so you probably won't see him much in the videos. And for those of you who send me messages asking me if I really have six or eight dogs or something like that, I don't, I only have two, but I do babysit the other little ones that you see. Okay, anyway, let's get started on the DIY project. The ingredients you need for this recipe are half a cup of salt, one cup of flour, some water, and if you're colouring it, some turmeric as well. Place flour in a large bowl. Add your salt. And at this point, you can add your food colouring, or in this case, I added some turmeric. And mix it all together to blend well. After you're done, you can proceed to add water gradually. You add your water a little bit at, at a time. For this specific recipe, I used about 3 quarters of a cup of water. Mix well till it starts forming a dough. Once you're done, transfer it to a board and start kneading it till it comes together. It needs to be nice and soft and easy to mold. When it's quite smooth, form a little ball like this and stick your finger in it. If it holds the shape well, it means you're ready to eat it. At this point, I decided to test it and see if it worked. It's not that easy trying to get your dog to stick his paw into a piece of dough. Oh, it's that paw! Ta-da! You want to bake this in a 180 degrees Celsius oven for about 15 minutes. The time will vary depending on the size of your dough, but it takes roughly 15 minutes to cook a piece like this. For tips on decorating and storing your new paw print, visit www.feedmypaws.com He's still trying to eat it. No, eat it. No, 